Rumen function is a complex process. The structural carbohydrates in the plant cell wall consist primarily of cellulose, hemicellulose, pectin, and lignin. After rumen degradation, the non-lignified tissues disappear, leaving only the non-degradable lignified tissues. It is only the microorganisms living in the rumen and the large intestine that are able to digest plant wall cells. Their dry weight in the rumen of the cow is about 4 kilograms. The microbial population is made up of a varied population of protozoa, bacteria, and fungi. The rumen contains some 10 billion bacteria per milliliter. The bacteria make up about 50% of the microbial biomass and represent the microorganism category which is the most complex and abundant. This microflora is essentially composed of strict anaerobic bacteria and is characterized by its great diversity. At the present time, more than 200 species have been isolated. Species are generally classified according to the substrates they use and the metabolites that they produce. The bacteria are the most important microbes from the point of view of digestion, but other groups like protozoa play an essential role. Most of the protozoa are ciliates. Their concentration is about one million per milliliter of rumen fluid. Though lower in number than bacteria, their greater size gives them an almost equal share of dry weight. The ciliate protozoa actively participate in protein, carbohydrate, starch, lipid, and sugar degradation. The ingestion of particles precedes degradation. In the case of a rich supply of sugar or starch, as on a high concentrate diet, they can store part of the nutrient ingested as skeletal plates or starch granules. They also regulate bacterial fermentation by limiting the quantity of sugars available to the bacteria. The activity of protozoa in cellulolysis is recognized as being positive for animals receiving low quality roughages. In contrast, their predation towards bacteria and intense hydrolytic action of the proteins have prompted certain researchers to suggest an elimination of protozoa in animals having high requirements for amino acids and those receiving diets low in protein content. There are also other types of organisms, the rumen fungi. The rumen fungi produce all the enzymes necessary to hydrolyze and ferment cell wall carbohydrates, with the exception of pectin. Since much of the nutrient supply to ruminants is dependent on growth of the rumen bacteria, reduced bacterial activity can reduce nutrient flow from the rumen. Within the rumen, yeast culture functions to increase the quantity of nutrients available for milk or meat production by selectively stimulating certain key groups of rumen microbes, such as those which digest ration fiber or bacteria which metabolize lactic acid. The aim is to control the rate of fermentation and achieve a fermentation pattern optimum for milk or meat production in a given situation.